There we go. See, it messed it up. But now I can just slide that into place and we're good. There we go. Okay, um... Oh. Oh. Excuse me. How do I delete you? Oh, I need to kill you. Um... How do I... Delete? How do I delete? Is there, like, can I delete you? No, I want to delete you. Yes! Right click is delete. Fuck you! You're dead! New! No. Oh god, please, please don't, please don't. Richard was my old middle name, and I'll, I will say that one out loud because I, I made a joke about that at the start of my transition, that uh, in the course of my transition, there would be two dick removals going on. Um, first would be my name change. Uh, so that's my middle name, and I don't know why. <laughs> well, I mean, like, my, my, my parents were assholes, but they gave me one, uh, one amazing joke opportunity. <laughs> Hello everyone, um, this is going to, I, I don't know how to say this, um, I, I have to cut out the next bit, uh, until we start playing the game, because it turns out, um, despite being a part of the game, uh, Blue Moon by Frank Sinatra is a, uh, copyrighted still, um, song, and that plays in the intro for Fallout New Vegas, which means I can't play any of the intro to this game without getting copyright struck. So, small cut. Usually this isn't going to happen. VODs I don't normally uh, cut anything into, so um, rare chance that we get to go and do one of these. Uh, so, yeah. Just so everyone knows, my Twitch account did not get copyright striked. Um... I got the sound blocked out, and my account was fine. Um, it just, this happened, so... But we're fine, okay? Just enjoy the cut. We're good. Enjoy the game. Have fun. War. War never changes. When atomic fire consumed the Earth, those who survived did so in great underground vaults. When they opened, their inhabitants set out across the ruins of the old world to build new societies, establishing villages, forming tribes. As decades passed, what had been the American Southwest united beneath the flag of the new California Republic, dedicated to old world values of democracy and the rule of law. As the Republic grew, so did its needs. Scouts spread east, seeking territory and wealth in the dry and merciless expanse of the Mojave Desert. They returned with tales of a city untouched by the warheads that had scorched the rest of the world and a great wall spanning the Colorado River. The NCR mobilized its army and sent it east to occupy Hoover Dam and restore it to working condition. But across the Colorado, another society had arisen under a different flag. A vast army of slaves forged from the conquest of 86 tribes, Caesar's Legion. Four years have passed since the Republic held the dam, just barely, against the Legion's onslaught. The Legion did not retreat. Across the river, it gathers strength. Campfires burn training drums beat. Through it all, the New Vegas Strip has stayed open for business under the control of its mysterious overseer, Mr. House. 
and his army of rehabilitated tribals and police robots. You are a courier, hired by the Mojave Express to deliver a package to the New Vegas Strip. What seemed like a simple delivery job has taken a turn for the worse. You got what you were after, so pay up. You're crying in the rain, Pally. <laughs> Guess who's waking up over here? Time to cash out. Will you get it over with? Maybe cons kill people without looking them in the face. But I ain't a fink. Dig? You've made your last delivery, kid. Sorry you got twisted up in this scene. From where you're kneeling must seem like an 18 karat run of bad luck. Truth is, the game was rigged from the start. You know, kind of squishy. There's a little squishy sound. Um, I'm pleased with that addition, but also horrifying. Okay. I just added everything anyways. You're awake. How about that? Well, so much for the faithful experience. Oh, easy there. Easy. You've been out cold a couple of days now. Why don't you just relax a second? Get your bearings. Let's see what the damage is. How about your name? Can you tell me your name? Uh, I'm Tally. I can't say it's what I'd have picked for you, but if that's your name, that's your name. I fucking picked it myself, bitch! Welcome to Good Springs. Now, I hope you don't mind, but I had to go rooting around there in your... One second. Is it under display? There you go. You know, nowadays... Michael Hogan? You know more about this game than I do. I'm, I'm gonna... I might need to request that you just attend all streams in the future. Um... <laughs> if we're gonna do... If we're gonna do Fallout New Vegas on Sundays, I might... I might, uh, I might have to request that you, uh... That you show up consistently. So we've, we've got a Canadian voice actor, right off the bat. Uh, audio. Yeah, we're good. Ooh, wait. Do I need to worry about copywritten music? I probably have to worry about copywritten music, don't I? This is from the 60s, so... What do you mean by radio? I, like... I don't know what it means by music. I don't know if that means like background, like cinematic music. I'm just gonna assume it means cinematic. I'm turning off the radio though, so I don't have to listen to that. Cause I know I know nothing about this game. Noggin to pull all the bits of lead out. I take pride in my needlework. But you'd better tell me if I left anything out of place. How'd I do? Uh, horrible. Let's change that. That is also... Horrible. Uh, yeah, I'm white as fuck. Thank you. Oh no. Let's, let's... What are my customize options? 
light. Alright. Please give me like a semi-wide head. Uh, forehead. Overdoing that. Um, I don't know what that's doing. Okay. I, I hate this. Oh, yeah, no, we're gonna... Oh, that is... Uh oh There's something weird going on there. I know it's like, hey, don't look at the side profile, but like, y'all are doing some really friggin' weird stuff there. Now nah, we're gonna go low. I'm not trying to do constantly surprised. Eyes. Yeah, we're gonna go down. Uh, give us on the larger side. Well, see, that's not actually changing together or apart. That's just like eye width. Nose. Bridge depth. Semi large nose on me. Up and down. I'm hoping that I get to do something with the lips. Flat or pointed? Pointed, flat, pointed, more on the pointed side. Nostril tilt. Ooh. you short or long um gonna kind of do that to be honest god it's just okay didn't really have much of an option there um close mouth Small, large, large. I don't know if I'm liking this. Eye color. Dark brown. Tone. It's not too flushed. I don't know what the blue tint is, but I don't like that. Okay. Eye sockets color. Oh, well, no, we'll do that. Eyebrows. Ah, oh, no, well, I like the darkness. Thank you. Eyeliner. Yeah, no, eyeliner's good. Right there. Let's just zero the stash. I don't need beard. Thank you. Um, 
See, the thing is, though, is your, like, preset... So I can't really change the lips. They're just kind of stuck that way. I can work more with her than I can with any other preset. Like, high preset 10. Let's do a customization on the shape here. Uh, we're gonna do light. We're gonna do like that. We'll do this. Sort of. Go forward, back. No, we'll keep that there. Um. Okay. Brow. Low. There. There. Hair might help. Brow. Okay, well, we'll have to change that after. K. Okay, so eyes. Uh, let's do more on the downside. Let's keep it on the large side. Keep it on the apart. Um, nose, eyes, nose, uh, ridge depth. I'm gonna go that. Pointed. Excuse me. Pointed. You wanted tilt. Which that nostrils thin wide, thinner on the thinner side. Uh, cellian height. Is this change like that? Short, long. Shorten that in just a little bit. Back, mouth, underbite versus overbite. Definitely more of an overbite. And then you're going large or small. Yank. I'm assuming there's a jaw option. Low or high? Low or high? Low or high? We're gonna do high. Uh, shallow or pronounced? Whoa. Okay, convex. Convex. Shallow, pronounced. More. Weird stuff happening to you, lady. Jaw. Projected jutting. This. Thin wide. That's thin. That. I low. Up. Concave. Convex. Chin. Forward or backward? Ooh, that could actually be better. Hi. Hello. We're going to eat. All the short.
give you kind of a rounder face if we can. Best I can do. Okay. I'll hide her face with a mask. Stone. Shade. Pale. Pale as a ghost? No. Um. Paler. Little bit of flushing. A little bit less on the blue tint. Uh, a little bit more color on the eye sockets. A little bit more color on the eyebrows. Eyeliner. Nose. Lips. Thank you. Uh, zero mustache. Thank you. Cheeks. Yes. Cheek color. Zero beard. Back. Eye color. Dark brown. Thank you. Back. Back. Age. Old. No. Young. Did something weird there. Don't care. Think that might have fucked up everything. Who gives a shit? Hairstyle. Domestic goddess. No nonsense. Rapper, rough night. Wendy the welder. Do love me a ponytail, not gonna lie. Sophisticated, frazzled. Iron Maiden. What's with the hair wisps? Unladylike. Once again, what's with the hair wisps? Uh, Rude Ridge. Mangy. Fallen Angel. Fairy Tales. Shaved. Little Devil. Seductress. The Dragon. Last Pack. The Unsettler. Green Cut. Sarge. Was Cut. Uh, well, I'm kind of between the, like, Seductress option and, um... The Wendy the Welder. Let's be real. And just because this is like... Just because this is, um... Wait, wait, give me, give me your version of ginger. Thank you. What did you have? Ginger, honey. Rosewood. Alright, we're gonna go rosewood. But, uh, we're gonna bring up... I've been keep doing this for too long. Anyway. Stuff that mattered. Okay. Well, because, like, no sense if you have, like, if you're out in the middle of nowhere, you, you want your hair Let's up. See, you don't want it, like, you looking face. pretty, per se. Because, like, Good. lice and shit, like... Why don't you walk down to the end of the room? Over by that bigger tester machine there. Take it slow now. It ain't a race. You're really freaking close. I'm sitting in a chair. Awesome. Whoa. Is there such thing as a walk button? Hi. Um, settings. Controls. Action key mapping. Sneak, run, shift. Always run is caps lock. Auto move is Q. Caps lock should, caps lock should, okay, okay, okay. Um...
Okay, there we go. Looking good so far. Go ahead and give the vigor tester a try. What, what? We'll learn right quick if you get back all your faculties. Okay, you said what was the strength? Strength, perception, endurance, charisma, intelligence, agility, luck. Um how easy. Melee, unarmed, inventory weight, damage, weapon effectiveness. Perception is explosive, locks pick, energy weapon, accuracy, compass. Unarmed, health, resistance, survival. Barter, speech. You said don't, so we won't. Okay, well, I can immediately see... All skills. Enemy mishaps. Let's, let's drag that down for a second. I do tend to play sneaky characters. Because I know that luck is actually important. And I figure that's a decent rounding, you know? I got strength, I got agility. And I'll probably invest more in those as time goes on. But the luck is kind of like, it also affects, I think, your loot rolls as well. So having just a little bit above average luck is good. And I do tend to sneak more. And the reason I chose strength is because of carrying ability. But I do tend to sneak more, and I tend to use more long-distance weapons. And the intelligence is just for- because of the fact that I have low, uh, endurance. Huh. Must be some frontal lobe damage. Well, we know your vitals are good. But that don't mean them bullets didn't leave you nuttered in the bighorn and dropping. What do you say you take a seat in my couch and we go through a couple of questions? See if your dogs are still barking. All right, I'm gonna say a word. I want you to say the first thing that comes to mind. Dog. Wow, dog, cat, feed, newspaper, train, kick, dinner. Um, does that mean like train, like train it? Or does that mean like... I mean, this means eat it. What well, means train the dog? It doesn't mean like, okay, so it's not, it's not, it's not the, the bad shit insane that I am. Um, dog. I'm a cat person. Uh, okay. Night. Hmm. 
campfire. Enemy. Light. Dark. Mother. Jeans. Cookie jar. Tantrum. Tattle. Regret. Human shield. Cookie jar. Okay. Now I got a few statements. I want you to tell me how much they sound like something. <laughs> choo choo, said. motherfuckers. First yeah, one, no, absolutely. Conflict ain't in my nature. Uh. Well, I mean. Agree. I ain't given to relying on others for support. Agree. I'm always fixing to be the center of attention. No opinion. I still don't understand why people like me. I'm slow to embrace new ideas. Strongly disagree. I charge in to deal with my problems head on. Nope. Almost done here. What do you say you have a look at this? Tell me what you see. Broken chain, guardian, shadow on a door frame, losing wound, angry two-headed ant. Okay. How about this one? Last one. It's two bears high-fiving. You do not see that it is two bears. High fiving. Well, that's all she wrote. I don't have nothing to compare it to, so maybe you'd better just have a look at the results. See if it all seems right to you. Uh, okay, energy weapons. Interesting. Um, I want medicine. Sneak is good. Energy weapons. Those are late game. And like, I don't want to add speech to that because it's not one of my good skills. Sneak, medicine, melee weapons. Hair. See, this would be better. This would be better. The medicine allows me to... to replenish medicine. This is what I'm doing. Done. Before I turn you loose, I need one more thing from you. I got a form for you to fill out so I can get a sense of your medical history. Just a formality. Ain't like I expect to find you got a family history of getting shot in the head. Uh, two traits built to destroy. Weapons have 3% chance to critically hit, but equipment condition decays 15% faster. Nope. Um. Uh, not Doors, early bird, from 6 a.m. to 12 p.m., but suffer. Okay, yeah, no. Uh, while using guns and energy weapons. Accurate. Um, might consider that one. Good natured, hard, more prone to solving problems with your mind than violence. You gain plus five to barter medicine, repair, science, and speech, but a negative five to. Whoa. Energy weapons, explosive guns, melee weapons, and unarmed. Porter, you gain 25 pounds to your carrying capacity to all attributes anytime the weight you're carrying drops below 160 pounds. Uh, you have plus 10 in points, but your reckless nature gave you damage threshold. Um... Uh, 
quest twice as long, but after 30 you can kiss experience perks and skill points goodbye. Holy crap. Um... You gain plus 5 points to every skill, but you suffer negative 10 from experience gained from now on. Okay. Okay, well, I'm, I'm gonna choose this one because I'm okay with not being a fast fire. Um... Kind of want to click this one. Kind of want to click this one. I need, I need, I need people to tell me in chat. Should I click this one? Wild the uh, wild wasteland unleashes the most bizarre and silly elements of post-apocalyptic America. Not for the faint of heart or the serious of temperament. It's a good one. I should click it. Do it. I need one other person to vote for this. Redden, if you're in chat, I need you to vote. You can't Palpatine me on this, okay? I need at least one other person to say do it. I got a Corvid and I got General Five doing this, saying do it. I need one other person. I mean, do it is absent. That is true. I got a gold please in chat. Okay. All right. Well, there's a bunch of other people who are just watching to have fun. So uh, we're just going to... We're not going to wait too long on this. But I, I know... I know... Um, I know Oliver would, would tell me to do it. Um, assuming um, other people would tell me to do it. So we're going to do it. Um, okay. All right, I guess that about does it. Come with me, I'll see you out. Do I have, like, inventory or anything? Oh, Skyrim physics. Okay. Hmm. I don't know what any of this stuff does. Wait, am I technically stealing shit from him? really just here for your pencils. I don't know why I'm stealing pencils. all you had on you when you was brought in. 
I hope you don't mind, but I gave the note a look. I thought it might help me find an extra kin. But it was just something about a platinum chip. Well, if you're heading back out there, you ought to have this. They call it a pip boy. I grew up in one of them vaults they made before the war. We all got one. Ain't much use to me now, but you might want such a thing after what you've been through. I know what it's like having something taken from you. And put this on too, so the locals don't pick on you for lack and modesty. It was my wife's. I think she was about your size, and she hardly wore it after we left the vault. Felt it was too brazen. Thanks for patching me up, don't Doc. Mention it. It's what I'm here for. You should talk to Sunny Smiles before you leave town. She can help you learn to fend for yourself in the desert. She'll likely be at the saloon. I reckon some of the other folks at the saloon might be able to help you out too. And the metal fella, Victor, who pulled you out of your grave. Anyway, you ever get hurt out there, you come right back. I'll fix you up. But try not to get killed anymore. Hardcore mode allows you to play new hardcore mode. Really increases the challenge of the game, and this mode's impacts heal over time and cannot mend broken limb limbs. Right away removes radiation over time, ammunition has weight, and dehydration is a con constant concern. This mode is only working for advanced players. Um, you activate hardcore mode now and maintain it through the end of the storyline, you will receive a special reward. No. Look, I'm dumb. I'm not stupid. There's... There's a difference, okay? I'm a dumbass. Old World Blues has been loaded. Red by five. The boys received signal coordinates that lead to the canyon wreckage west of Prim. Don't know where that is. Friendly coordinates. Cabin increased by five. The Happy Trails Caravan Company. They're looking for one more member for an exposition to Zion Valley. Okay, um... Okay, um... I can't click any of that? Alright. Oh, I can click those. <laughs> All weapons fall under the weapon skill category that determines how effective the weapon is. Guns, energy, weapons, explosives, melee weapons, can armed. Uh, compare to the small icon below to the left of the weapons icon. Skill menu. These indicate the damage. Damage per second, retrospectively. Weapons with a low dam have difficulty penetrating armor. If you hit a target's damage threshold, switch to a weapon with a higher dam, or use ammo that reduces the target's damage threshold, e.g. armor piercing. Strength and skill. Many weapons have a strength and or skill requirement. If your character does not meet the strength or skill requirement for the weapon, its aim will wobble if a firearm, or it will attack more slowly if it if a 200 weapon. Condition. Weapon's condition affects the amount of damage it does. As in percent condition or higher, the weapon does maximum damage and, will, and only needs to be main, maintained. A weapon with low condition will do less damage and may jam when reloaded. Repair mod. These options take... You to the repair and mod submenus where you may repair damage equipment or attach weapon modifications respectively. Close. Okay. I got a 9mm pistol. I got... I don't know why those are weapons, but I got binoculars. Did I drop that? Give me that. Okay, so don't right right click is drop. Laser pistol condition is bad. Condition is bad.
Um, I'm going to keep those just at the bottom here, but uh, I'm going to go with the, the 9mm because that feels like I'm supposed to. Um, damage threshold to the wearer. Your DT is the sum of all DT for currently equipped apparel, plus any bonuses from perks or chems. DT is directly subtracted from incoming damage, so a higher DT provides superior protection. Though a small percent of the damage can get through, even with the thickest of armor, a high DT is quite valuable. Uh, apparel above 50% provides maximum protection. Equipped. Okay. Um. Okay. Wish I could, like, scrap those. Okay. Weapon repair kit. Bobby pin camera. I got pencils. Vault oh, 13 canteen. Wait, wait, hold up, hold up. Does that mean that the armored vault suit is the one that I want to do? Am I not understanding that right? Thank you. So if I slapped on the ball 21, what does this look like? That feels more in line with me being stupid. Dead money. It's by five. Um. Lightweight metal armor. Wait, wait, leather armor. Vault 13. Vault 21. How do I put you away? Okay, just hold R. Mailbox, it's empty. Ooh. Nope. I understand what that means. Please close. Oh. Dangerous. I was looking for caps so I could move. Uh, okay, so you want me to go here? Whoop, whoop, whoop. Content. Oh, that's a red. Wait. Good springs or no, not good springs. Open 24 hours. Bunch of junk bikes outside. Who the heck is Easy Pete? Hi. Howdy. What can Easy Pete do for you? The one in the fancy suit seemed to be calling the shots. That's as much as I know. Other folks in town might know more. Word of advice, though. If you ever catch up with him, watch out. The man's got cold eyes like a snake. Can't be trusted, I'd say. Sorry, just making sure that the uh, the sound's coming through. It's coming through kind of like quiet on my end. So just making sure that it wasn't uh, coming through just as quiet on your guys' end as well. Word of advice, though. Catch up with him, watch out. The man's got cold eyes like a snake. Can't be trusted, I'd say. The machine? Harmless. No matter what Trudy says. 
She thinks it's hiding something, but I think it's just a broken down relic with no place to be. Was a prospector until I decided to settle here to get away from the NCR. Now we'll just take it easy and help out with the Brahmin and Bighorners. Nah, nah. Means I poke through old buildings looking for working tech and such. Some folks just call it salvaging, but never like the term. The way I see it, salvage means it's broken, near worthless. Me, I look for the good stuff. Guns, chems, spare parts. Good money in it. Hmm. Nope. Had a pretty good claim once, way out east by the river, but got run off by raiders. Eventually got too old to keep going out. Don't get me wrong. The NCR's got a lot of decent folk in it. It's just that they make you part of them whether you like it or not. Towns like Good Springs and Prim don't stay independent for long. Not if you've got something the NCR wants. Still, the NCR keeps the Legion away. They're slavers, led by a guy named Caesar, or Kaisar. Not sure how you're supposed to say it. A couple of years ago, they tried to take over Hoover Dam, but the NCR beat them back. The NCR didn't or couldn't finish the job, though. The Legion's got its strength back and is getting ready for another round at the dam. My money's still on the NCR winning, but you never know. We've been hearing stories about Legionaries on the Nevada side of the river, so keep a gun handy. You don't want to get caught by them. Okay. The dam powers a lot of New Vegas. Then there's all that clean water lying in Lake Mead, too. Anybody who owns the dam owns the territory. Meat and hide, mostly. Can't put a pack on them. They just lay down until you take it off. Oh, I'm just making sure, like, if it's like... Bunch of wild ones high up the if the, the voice yeah, of careful. the, like, Easy Pete is, uh, um... Isn't coming through right, just let me know. Goodbye. Keep your gun handy if you go poking around some of the abandoned places around here, like the schoolhouse. Critters move in there sometimes. Nice. Um. I remember there being stuff here. This is a reloading bench. Hi, uh, workbench. Um. Okay. Uh, okay, so I need a buttload of stuff. Okay. Reloading bench. I don't want to break down nine millimeters. I want I want to make nine millimeter rounds. What do I need to make nine millimeter rounds? I need nine millimeter case. I need lead. I need pistol powder. Don't do that. Okay. Um, and I need primer, small pistol. Interesting. Um. Oh, those are the grenades. Those are shells. Except. Okay, I'll just break all of those down. How much weight did that put me at? Nothing? Awesome. Um. I don't want to do the 10 millimeter because I don't have a 10 millimeter pistol just yet, so we will do that. And Magnum, absolutely not. Hmm. 
No, nope, can't make anything else. So this is how I make... Don't know what this does. Uh, electron charge pack. Fission battery, okay. Cosmic knife spear. Coyote hide belt. Uh, dog hide belt. Gas bomb, gecko hide belt. Golden gecko hide belt. I don't know what these belts do. Knife spear. Cosmic knife. Duct tape. Rolling knife spear. Not sure what this does. Where's the ingredients required? It just gives me this is just scrap. Okay. Stim pack. My bomb weapon repair kit. Wrench. Okay. Well, this is why we had a bunch of stuff. Um, okay, I know I'm supposed to be going into hers, but at the same time... Oh, dumpster. Well, I want to see... I want to see... what some of this shit does. Because, like, we have... Misk. And some of the stuff has weight. Some of it doesn't. Sunset's Asperilla, okay. The exit. A take all. A take all. A take all. Can't take any of that. Can I see what this person's selling? Hi. Um. Wow, you're, uh. There's a lot of stuff. Uh, I really don't want to press E in here. You must be the one Doc Mitchell was patching up. The way I heard it, I didn't think you'd be walking out of that office. I've got plenty of supplies for sale. Even got some weapon mods and special ammo. Well worth the caps if you ask me. If you're hurting for caps, I've also got boxes of surplus ammo in the miscellaneous section. They're not great, but you get what you pay for. Um... It's all about quantity over quality. Trouble is, you'll be cleaning and fixing your gun a lot more than usual when you use those kind of bullets. The leader was a New Vegas type. Typical city boy. He had a bunch of great cons with him, probably hired guns. The great cons normally stay in their own territory way up northwest, on account of them being enemies with the NCR. Tell me about special ammo. Weapon mods are things like silencers, scopes, bigger magazines. Special ammo includes things like armor-piercing bullets, which don't hurt the target as much, but let you punch through armor easier. There's also hollow-point bullets, which have the opposite effect. You can kill unarmored targets easily, but mm -hmm. they don't do shit against armor. Hmm? Oh, okay, thank you. I've been told food is ready. Uh, I might... Oh, that actually smells awesome. Uh, um, if you've ever been to 
Both times I drank a lot of liquor and lost most of my caps at the card tables. In that order, now that I think about it. If you ever get to New Vegas, be sure to visit Gamora. It's the best casino in the city. You won't regret it. Word of advice, behave. Between the NCR military police and Mr. House's robots, you don't want to be causing trouble on the strip. I'm afraid I don't know much myself. Mr. House has got his own casino, Lucky 38, but nobody goes in or out except his robots. The other casinos follow Mr. House's rules, so I guess that makes him the leader of New Vegas. As far as I know, nobody's ever laid eyes on the guy. I think that robot who pulled you out of the dirt belongs to Mr. House. If Mr. House is looking after you, it's got to be a good thing, right? They're tough sons of bitches. Mean, but not crazy. They'll leave you alone unless you got something they want. The Great Khans deal in illegal chems. There's a good chance that most chems you come across were made by Great Khans. Can do. Kita, like, which group is the communist out of these, uh, out of everybody? That, that's the thing. I'm not, I'm not seeing a lot of, uh... Okay, well, here's the thing. LR. Is that rifle rounds? I've only got a nine, like, if I'm checking my... I'll be back in a sec. Well...
Okay. Sorry, my cats are, uh, tiny. No. Tiny little menace menaces that believe that the world is owed to them. Which means they commonly try to steal my food. So, um, thing is... Lightweight leather, lightweight metal. Mercenaries grenade li rifle. Sturdy caravan shotgun. Uh, travel rating armor. Other ten millimeter ten millimeter pistol. I'll stick with the nine. Um. I don't need the. F okay, I don't need the forty millimeter grenade. I know that you, I've, I've costed you too much. That's fine. Um. Okay. That's that. Weapons. Boxing tape, laser pistol. Oh. Silenced 22 pistol. What? 9 mil. That's just normal leather armor. A pre war hat. Aid. Smash. How many stim packs do I got? Twelve? I should be good. Misc. There we go. Surplus. So bulk. Case Magnum 6. Coffee cut. Duct tape. Laser pistol recycler. And pressure cooker, scrap metal. Special toaster. Okay, well, since you're not there and Ammo. Do you have nine mils? You have... Okay, wait. The weapon that you listed... It's LR. For the silenced. Misc, ammo. Nine millimeter round, there we go. Penetrating round. Follow points. Do I want to grab silenced twenty two? Probably. This one has higher condition. Probably take both just to see if I can use one to repair the other. 
and I haven't even sold the armored jumpsuit yet. Which means Stores all body parts. Yeah, well, I'll like I'll take items back if he doesn't have it. Um, I wonder. Now I owe him caps. Okay, so that was. That was too much. It's 404 caps. There we go. Except. Exit. Another satisfied customer. Uh, satisfied, yes. Take it easy now. I now have, when it comes to um, ammo, all point overcharge slug. <laughs> equip them on this menu outside of the boy. Press two to cycle through ammo types for your currently equipped weapon. Okay. Um, I have this, but the problem is, is that weapon wise, that's got some really low, like, this has got some really low condition. You can see that in the corner. Um, whereas this is technically higher. So I'm going to see if I can, if I can de-piece one to repair the other. if I can even do that. I'm not going to break down those. I guess I'm just going to have two of those pistols. But yeah, I want I wanted ammo because um, like not only did it reduce my weight to do that. Mm. Sorry, playing with tumbleweed. Cheyenne, stay. Don't worry, she won't bite unless I tell her to. Yeah, I guess there's a thing or two I could show you. Sounds like you need all the help you can get after what they done to you. Meet me outside, behind the saloon. Awesome, that was quick. Oh, but that's a that's an actual good book. Oh, but that would give me bad karma. I know karma's in this game. I'm not even allowed to steal any of this. That Doc Mitchell sure knows his stuff, doesn't he? That Doc Mitchell sure knows his stuff, doesn't he? Way too many strangers coming into town these days. No offense. Way too many strangers coming into town these days. No offense. Um, yeah, I'm just not gonna do illegal shit. You know, I'm gonna be a good soul. I thought you were gonna flush it, not drink from it. Fucking Neanderthal. Now, 
See the sarsaparilla bottles on the fence there? Take this and try to hit a couple of them. Nice. Zoom in. Thank you. I was right over that. What the heck? That's the right idea. Look down the site. Try crouching down and staying still. It'll help your aim. Nice shot. Well, that's a start. But I don't reckon you came to me to learn to fight sarsaparilla bottles. Tell you what. I gotta go chase geckos away from our water supply anyway. Darn critters are attracted to it. Why don't you come along? Follow me. It's just down to the southeast a short ways. Oh, I can't pick these up. Okay. Uh, how do I run? How do I sprint? Because shift just slows me down. I don't know why I would do that. Um, settings, controls, action mapping, uh... Lock, left, alt. Okay. Sneak, run is shift. Always run is caps lock. So where's sprint? I, there's no sprint. Okay. Interesting. Interesting. Hear that up on the ridge behind me there? We got some geckos to clear out. Bunch of little monsters is what they are. Seems like Doc Mitchell treats more gecko bites than anything else. Let's see if we can get a little closer. If we move quietly, we can get the jump on them. More likely to hit something vital that way. Okay, you're on. Go give them hell. I don't even know how to, like, I don't even know how I was triggering, triggering bats. Hello? Pick these up. He's just set dressing. Okay, well, I'll stop sneaking. That first shot, though, was, uh, I'm, I'm impressed. V for Vats. See, you just told I see V for Vats, and then, yeah. See? You're getting the hang of it. There's two more wells <laughs> that still need clearing. If you want, you can come along. It'd be worth a few caps to me. 
Shouldn't take more than a couple minutes, especially with two of us. Come with me. Where did she go? Did she drop her weapon? Oh, poor lady's dead. Yeah, I will. I just need to. Good spring settler. Taking your shit. Tin can, tin can, tin can. Large whiskey bottle. Pretty sure I can use these for something. I'm sure I got weight. Can't take the buckets, but I can take the whiskey bottles. Exit, okay. Care of you. Pretty sure I took care of you. Yep. She's dead. Sucks a lot. Am I sure that I can use this somewhere? Probably. Monica, suitcase empty. Oh, you can sleep. This girl was just getting fucking drunk. Salient green. I have gecko meat. Can I make like gecko food? Dog meat. Dog steak. There's gecko kebabs, but I need like. Oh, there we go. Oh, but I can't do that because my survival's not high enough. Well, that's problematic. Well, I gotta go up there. Because I don't think that's gonna give me... Wow. 
No. Okay. Hell's bells. There's not a day passes by I don't tell people not to come here by themselves. Some people, your word just isn't good enough for them. Then this happens. Well, it's a part of life out here. Best to accept it. But you did what you promised. Staying out here with me. Here's my end of the deal. One more thing I wanted to show you. Thought I might teach you about living off the land and making useful things for yourself. Interested? Ah, heck, couldn't hurt. Then we'll need a couple ingredients to get started. Gonna want some Xander root and a Brock flower. Let me think now. I know I've seen Brock flowers growing up at the graveyard, and I seem to remember there being Xander root over by the schoolhouse. Bring those on back to me, and we'll get cooking. Here's two general locations that you're just gonna know where those are. Is this an Indiana Jones reference? Because like these two items This one has better DT. I'm just not using the uh, the Vault 13 armored one until later. Is there is there like a map? Do I have a map? World map. This is technically closer. My hat looks stupid. It is indeed an Indiana Jones, Jones reference. That's, that's Victor's shack, okay. Future weapons today. Is this an, is this an aid item? Um, is that like a temporary statistic? Can 
Nice. Um, whoa. I see reds. I am a rifle type. Why is it that I can't seem to hit you guys? Is there like a way that I can shoot you? Hi, um... Oh, a temporary skill boost. Okay, I was wondering if that was like permanent. Um... Future weapons today wore off, okay. Okay, what did you say that there was around here? I feel like I should be sneaking. I, why can't I kill you? Also, why am I using that weapon when clearly I've broken stealth? So I missed them, they're outside. Great. Meeting people, that's nice. What's the safe? I need a stock pick skill. I need a science skill. Wonder glue. Programmer's digest.
Am I injured? Nah. Just gonna run around. Hey. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. Got you killed. Oh. I'm assuming that I can do stuff with stuff like that. You're empty. You're empty. You're empty. You're empty. I've already looted you. What I wouldn't give for, like, loot vision. You know, just to see. Whoa. All the message for sex-based terms. W why would auto- I don't have auto mod on. Oh, wow. Okay. I will try the computer digest and I will see what happens. Oh, I can save. I'll do a new save. There we go. Middle box. Loved it. I don't know why, I'm, I'm just- I'm just looting things. It's just... How I- I do. Old schoolhouse. Locker. Ooh, that locker's got nine caps in it. Little box, new Coca-Cola truck. Not letting me get underneath it, I see. Alright. Nice broom. Body pin. Ooh, body pin. I'm sorry, is there anything else I'm missing? Box of detergent. Under glue tin can. Mm. Oh, wait, that's a bobby pin. Um, AIDS Programmer's Digest. If four tries to guess correctly, if you fail a terminal, will remain accessible until you own the password. And however, exiting terminal will force the security reset, delaying your ability to restart hacking again. Okay. Wondering. Oh, this is replenished. Okay, so screwed that one up. Bed removed. Okay, so I, I've done this before. Just not in this game. I had a feeling. I was like, wait, I've done this before. I'm not gonna touch that one because that one could be a tries reset. One more left. Two out of seven, correct. Okay. So herself is two out of seven, correct? Um, so... There's two incorrect in this. So H-E is 
and then A D H E R S E L T H. So we can try headset. That's one correct. So headset's one correct. So this is two. The only ones that they match are the E. H E R S E L. No, that's no, that's not there. There's no two in that one. Um, H E R. Okay, S E L. F. But then we have H E A D. S-E-T, that could be a possible one. We're two in. It would be wise. That's a dud removed. Shit. Okay. Okay, so for self and headset, are similar. Periods has two. Um, H-E-R again. S-E-L-T-H. And then this is H-E-A-D-S-E-T. So Sered is another one. H-E-R-S-E-L-T-H. Uh, okay, heated. Then this is H-E-A-D, so it's no, this is a no, because this would have three, this only had one. The periods and, cera and ceramic are options. Okay, I'm gonna use note paper for this because I can and I have a wealth of little writing materials, so let's try this. So with the two that we have, we know that periods is one, we know that ceramic is one, hearted isn't. Uh, H E R S E L P T H K. But then the other one is H E A D S E T. So sermons is also one. Uh, er, so no, um, but that does have the two there. H-E-A-D-S-E-T does not, so service is another one that could technically work. Because we only get one guess after this. H-E-R-S-E-L-F. Uh, This is not one. Nervous is H E R S E L F. And then H E A D S E T. So nervous is another one. H E R S H E R S E. Nope, that's three. That doesn't work. Evans is cut out. H E R S E L F. Nope. H E R S E L F. Technically, H E A D S E T. Serving is another one. Uh, it depends, because if, if it doesn't have any of the. Um, what I'm looking for are ones that have potential crossover. 
with the other available ones that are left. Um, so not just two, I, I want the ones that, yeah, like you said, like serving, nervous, uh, service, and sermons can technically all cross each other over. ER. S no, herself no. That one, that one's three. H E R S E L F no. H E R S E L F no. Okay. So we have the three that we have, but you're right. Choosing one of them. Okay, okay. So how this works is, is kind of simple. Um, there are little things like this um, that sometimes give you uh, options to remove um, password options. So if you go through those, you can limit the amount of um, password options you have. And then, like uh, A Corvid said in chat, um, you can then, it gives you uh, however many characters were correct. And so then what you're doing is you're just trying to match um, the words together. So in this case, um, serving nervous service and sermons are all ones that could be uh, useful. The one I'm going to choose is nervous because it's got the um, the S for sermons and the O. Um, it's got the S for periods as well. Um, it's got the V from service. And it's also got the V from serving. So nervous is one of those ones that that it picks it really well as an option to choose simply because it has the most uh likability between all options so then it kind of makes it easier to to reduce down so this is also two out of seven correct so that means this was still two So then that means if this is still, if nervous is still two, then sermons is crossed out. Um, service is crossed out. Serving is crossed out because those are all ERV. Which leaves. And because Nervous has an S on the end, it removes periods, so the answer has to be ceramic. Uh, where is ceramic? There you go. Basically, it's just... Yeah. Like, you just, you just gotta write them all out, and you gotta, like, go through them. It's... I don't know, I... I find that kind of fun because I've I've done like software engineering and computer coding and stuff like that and it's just like mm. the satisfaction of working through a problem. Uh, bottle cap fixer meant to ask pre-war money, psycho, stealth boy, super stimpack. Exit. Awesome. So wait, these things? Do I need to like hit them with a weapon or something? Yeah. You were like, it's those little things outside, and I'm like, I don't I can't press E on them. These? Why can't I press E? These? Those are jalapenos. Who was I looking for? Data, quests, rock flower, and xander root. You press E things. I won't need to hit it. I won't need to hit it with a stick. Oh, 
it's getting hot in here. One second. My poor PC is just trucking along. Near a tree stump. There's a tree stump here. Oh, that wasn't it. That might have been a rock. Who fucking knows? Mm -hmm. What was that? that so easily? Howdy, partner! Might I say you're looking fit as a fiddle? Don't mention it. I'm always ready to lend a helping hand to a stranger in need. I was out for a stroll that night when I heard the commotion up the old bone orchard. Saw what looked like a bunch of bad eggs, so I laid low. Once they'd run off, I dug you up to see if you were still kicking. Turns out you were. So I hauled you off to the dock right quick. Can't say that I'm familiar with the rascals. Some of the fine folks in town not be able help you out with that. I moseyed into town, oh, 10, 15 years ago. Before that, I... Um, I can't quite seem to recall. Odd. Anyway, it's a right peaceful town, and I reckon it's as fine a place to settle as any. I'm a Securitron. Robco secured the Model 26 of the B. If you ever see any of my brothers, tell them Victor says howdy. Happy trails! Interesting. Interesting. Trek Deep Space Nine. I wonder I wonder who's wonder who. Couldn't be Varric, could it? Quest again. Four rock flower. Sloan. Okay. Is voiced by Odo. Oh no. Yeah. Wow. 
I was looking up. I was not looking down. Uh, items. 22 sounds pistol with only 11 shots left. Well, that killed my stealth, so... No wonder. Hi. Well, evidently I have messed up. aim you. You're not a really an aimable weapon. I think I think I very much like the varmint rifle. Because, you know. Oh, that sucks. There we go. Yeah, 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 yeah. You gonna do that all over? Come on, run away. Interesting. Why am I here? I oh. don't Okay, I just don't want to fucking deal with this. Ah. Oh. Well, I didn't want to shoot the raven, because, you know, that's against my religion, but, anyway. Banton can, Banton can. Boom set, sarsaparilla. Hi, I'm a garbage collector. Rock flower. None of that. J. Renzal. Can you? Making sure. Whoop. Danny Lava. Uh. Well, you're no one remembers you. Um. Count Abraham Jefferson the third. No one there. With whiskey snake junior huh. rest in peace mr r horn
Mr. J. R. Smith. Here lies Beryl. My stats at? I haven't hit a few times. Am I just like healing? Interesting. Interesting. Unmarked grave. I could open all these graves if I have a shovel. If I do this, it goes. You need a shovel to dig here. Okay. So apparently my uh, 9mm pistol is just a slight bit better than the rifle now, for some reason. Fluid flies are icky, I just saw that. I do my best not to think about them while I'm eating. I love that uh, music. It's very spooky. I know it doesn't mean shit, though. Toolbox! Taking all that. Turn you off. Box, nothing. Box, nothing. Hey! There's a shovel? There is a shovel by one of the water valves near Sunny, if you can spot it. Well, we'll see. Let me see what you got. Yeah, these will do just fine. Just fine. All right, now. We're going to be making something folks on the trail call healing powder. Go on over to that campfire now. Give it a try. Hi, what's this? Healing powder. Okay. Hey, that's not bad, see? All it takes to make a recipe is the right ingredients and the right know-how. Sometimes it won't be a campfire you need. Might need to do some work on your guns and ammo, maybe. Important thing to get is it's all the same idea. You just need to find the right place to set up shop. Workbench or reloading bench, whatever. Well, I hope that's enough to get you started. I'm heading back now. Hope I didn't miss anything good on the jukebox. Cheyenne would never forgive me. Hey, do me a favor. Trudy, she's the bartender up at the Prospector. Kind of the town mom. She likes to meet newcomers. She'd be cross with me if I didn't ask you to poke your head in and say hi. I'm gonna find a shovel and uh, dig up some graves, because I'm a... Uh... Well, I don't steal from people, but I'll steal from the dead. I wouldn't really do that in life, let's be real. I'm not- I'm not that kind of person. Oh, 
Well, I'm like really far. I have moved where I was sitting and I am surprised that my poor little camera was was picking up my my faces accurately. Because it doesn't like to do that too often. Okay, wait, you said by the other water valves. Okay, well, here's one. Said if I can spot it. Hmm, mm, that's exposed water. I should not be uh, utilizing that. Behind a bush, leaning on a pipe. It's not something I knocked over at. Hey! Found it! <coughs> Basically just three stooged myself and whacked myself in the face with it, but hey! <laughs> Thank gosh, I don't have to worry about hunger. Actually, I have a question about eight items. Uh, what does the Sunset Sarsaparilla do? Oh, it lets me heal health. And I got a bottle cap. It's just a soda. Okay, wait. Where was... Where's the boneyard? That's... Data. No. Good Spring Source, Good Spring Cemetery. No, I don't want. I just want to, like, mark it. Yeah. I want to mark it. Sunset Sarsaparilla wore off. Can I harvest this? No. No. Because that would be rude. Okay. The problem is, is I have now uh, jumped over the fence, so... Mailbox. Wait, leather belt? What is a leather belt? Is there like any way I can like get an item detail? Is it just... Something funky? Whoop! A box! I'll take that. Mm -hmm. I already stole from you. What? Door to Good Springs home. I don't know whose home it is. Okay, uh... I've actually had sarsaparilla before. I did not like it. Um... Someone was like, hey, try this. And I was like, okay, and yet... Yeah, mm, mm mm um, I understand it's an acquired taste. It is not a taste I wish to acquire. Um, I'm not going to say it's bad. I just did not enjoy it. Like, there's very few things in life where it's like, I'm like, oh, this is awful. I don't want to taste this. Like, it was just certain things where it's just like the, the texture, the texture of the liquid and the taste was not something I was expecting. And I was like, I am good. I'm, I'm. I'm gonna hand this back to somebody, and, uh, you can, you know... Awesome. Hi. Uh, here lies Veril. Hi, Veril. 
Nice to meet you. I am a heartless piece of shit. Hi. I love those rounds. Can I jump over you? Thank you. Am I a grave robin? Yup. Apparently I should be getting a Magnum 37 or a 357. Um Keep out. All right. Well, I'm going to keep uh <laughs> that shovel on me now for ever and ever because uh yeah kind of seems like it might be useful if they make jokes about me smelling like corpse i'm gonna hmm. go on a shooting spree oh uh tab Data. Remove it. <laughs> I'll get Elks. Anything I can take from you? No? Okay. I had a figure. What I wouldn't give to be able to pick you all up. But while we're here, I don't want to break down the 9mm, I want to, like, repair it. Okay, so this is, this is exclusively ammo. I will accept that. I don't know what a gecko hat belt is. But okay. Wonder glue, duct tape, scrap electronics, scrap metal, wrench. Okay. Uh, items, weapons. I can mod you, but I can't repair you. That's nicer. Too bad I don't have a lot of those left. Uh, that I can sell. That I'm keeping. That I can also sell. Um, now we'll need to find another varmint rifle. Or another 9mm pistol. Where are you going? Ah, oh. fine, I'll go find a ditch to sleep in. Hey, would you, would you mind if I could just, no. I'm done being nice. If you don't hand Ringo over soon. I'm going to get my friends, and we're burning this town to the ground. Got it? We'll keep that in mind. Now, if you're not going to buy something, get out. What the hell is your problem? You. Well, you've been causing quite a stir. Glad I finally got to meet you. Welcome to the Prospector Saloon. Looks like our little town got itself dragged into the middle of something we don't want anything to do with. About a week ago, this trader, Ringo, comes into town. Survivor of an attack, he says. Bad men after him. Needs a place to hide. We figured he was just in shock. 
so we gave him a place to lie low. We didn't actually expect anyone to come after him. Okay. Oh, okay. He's holed up at the abandoned gas station up the hill. Some of the others, like Sonny, will probably stand up for Ringo if he asks for help, which he hasn't. Personally, I hope he sneaks out of town one night and takes the powder gangers with him. Chain gangs, really. The NCR brought them in from California to work on the rail lines. Problem is, it turns out that giving convicts a bunch of dynamite and blasting powder isn't the best idea. Yeah, it was a big no. escape not too long ago. Some of them stuck together so they could make trouble. That's what we're dealing with now. You mean murder him? That's not our way, even if Cobb is scum. He can bluster and threaten all he wants. No, I want to talk about something else. All right. I'll just show up and kill him, come back, be like, okay, we're done. He's a convict, just without the chains. Said his name was Cobb. Powder gangers is what they call themselves. Plenty more like him out there. If you were able to get Ringo out of this mess, you'd have a decent reputation around Good Springs. I'd even set you up with a discount. Of course, helping Ringo would also make the powder gangers mad. And they've got a lot of friends out there. Oh, okay, okay. Don't know why you want to do a thing like that. Yep, you'd get on their good side, but people around here wouldn't appreciate it one bit. <sighs> I know that thing as much as anyone else around here. It mostly keeps to itself, which is just fine by me. Other than rolling around once in a while, it doesn't do anything useful as far as I can tell. I don't know why it took an interest in you, but I'd be careful. It's never helped anyone before. It acts friendly enough, but I don't trust that whole cheerful cowboy act. I find it all very creepy. It was here when I took over the saloon seven years ago. Some people have said its owner lived here, but no one knows who it was. Fine by me. I'm grilling you for questions. I got uh, I got questions. I need a answers. Not much, other than there are a bunch of freeloaders who expected a few rounds on the house. I was able to get them to pay up, though. Of course, one of the great cons did knock my radio to the floor by accident, and it hasn't been working since. They were having some kind of argument about it, but the guy in the checkered coat kept shushing them. It sounded like they came in from the north through Quarry Junction. If that's the case, I can't say I blame them for not wanting to go back. That whole area is overrun with the kind of critters that just get mad if you shoot them. Merchants avoid that whole stretch of I-15 like it's radioactive, which it could be for all I know. I didn't hear exactly, but the leader was talking about the strip. Fellow wants to get there and avoid the 15, he'd have to go east. Take Highway 93 up. Sure, the outside looks okay, but I think something broke on the inside. There'd be caps in it for you. I do like to hear what's going on in the world. And that Mr. New Vegas seems like such a gentleman. Mostly traders looking to buy bighorn or meat and hides. The traders are the main reason the general store manages to stay in business. Most travelers heading south on the I-15 just push on towards Prim, unless they're in desperate need of supplies. There's always something interesting going on, but the biggest news has to be the coming dust-up between the NCR and the Legion over the dam. The new California Republic's got the most power in Nevada, Money, troops, you name it. They do what they can to keep <laughs> things safe in the region. I don't care about your radio. Well, see, I want to be nice. They're spread too thin. Oh, 
I'm pretty sure the NCR wants to hold on to the dam because it's one of the few places around that can make electricity. The Legion are a bunch of savages, though. No idea why they'd want the dam. Probably plan on destroying it or something. Slavers, killers, and all other kinds of trouble. They dress up like Roman soldiers, so there's no mistaking it when you see them. The rumor is, is that the Legion is far larger than the NCR lets on, and that it's been due to luck that the Legion hasn't overrun the territory. What do you have to say? I'm sure I've got something you like. All right, so... Pretty much nothing that I want. That's okay. I do have a buttload of weight, though. Um, you can take this. And the cleaver. You'll probably make better use out of that than I will. Uh, let's see. Just not gonna take that. Okay. Uh, yeah, I don't know what the scrap is for. Like, ashtray is weight, bent tin can is weight. But it all just says it's scrap, so I don't know. Or does that mean it's junk? One of her magazines. Fixing things, meeting people. I think I've got meeting people. I don't have Salesman Weekly, though. All of this. Like, I don't know if I'm gonna need the empty Nuka Cola bottles or if that's just trash. I think I'll just sell that to the general store. Um. But, like, I just don't know what a lot of this does. I'll just accept it now. Thanks. Be careful out there. Where's your fucked up radio? Oh, I lost it on the counter. Yeah, I just assumed I had the skill. I don't actually know if I have the skill. I just do things. You said repair? 20 or greater? Yeah, I got 34. Uh, no, 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 it's because I opened up the command line. There we go, okay. Whoa, level two. Uh, 14 skill points, oh no. Um. See, I did not know this about survival. Uh, barter, energy weapons, explosives, guns, medicine. Science. Workbenches. Guns. It turns effective to any app. Uses conventional ammunition. Energy weapons. Um. I think what I want to do. Because I'm kind of good on sneak for the moment, and I am level 2. So I can get you up to 25. Um, for the science and for the, the lock picking.
You know what? We'll go down to three and we'll slam speech. Um, 21. Because the thing is, is like there's also stuff that I could do at a survival bench. Let's just do that. Um, Well, having looked at all of these, I'm gonna have to say I'm gay. Hello. Hi. Feeling thirsty? Fix your radio. Yeah, I heard it turn right back on after you got done tinkering with it. Here's some. Oh, I'm not bartering. Thank you for the caps. Be careful. I'm a communist. I'll take what you give me. I'm not gonna go barter. I'm not some capitalist. Can't make shit. Okay. Can make stuff, but not the stuff that I want. Oh wow. Okay. Uh, what? What's the time? Actually, cancel. Uh, doctor, doctor, doctor. Give me the news, I gotta. Okay, so I Actually, I don't like you, but still. Kinda weird, but, uh. Hmm, interesting. Welcome back. I have. I didn't see him or the men with him. You might ask around town, though. Could be someone saw which way they was headed. Your best bet would probably be Trudy, the bartender at the saloon up the road. If anyone saw anything, she'd know about it. That'd be Victor. Curious fella. He's sort of odd, and I don't just mean because he's a robot. I couldn't tell you much about him. He's real friendly, don't get me wrong. You just get the sense that that ain't the whole picture. You just a feeling. He keeps to himself, mostly. You want to know more about him, you'll have to ask him yourself. He has a shack on the southern edge of town. This here's Good Springs, named after the water we got here, just down the road to the southeast. Good Spring Source, they call it. It's a quiet town, and that's how we like it. We don't go looking for trouble, though occasionally it sees fit to come looking for us. Well, I already told you I came from a vault. After that, I was a traveling doctor for a spell. It seemed like a good idea at the time. Most folks out here ain't educated, so people with medical know-how are hard to come by. I found that I could help a lot of people with what I knew, and that was all right with me. Eventually, I went back and married my childhood sweetheart, and that was the end of my traveling days. Didn't miss it none then. Still don't. Well, there's a general store just up the road, run by a fella named Chet. He don't got nothing fancy, but he's got your basics covered. If you're looking to wet your whistle, just past Chet's is the Prospector Saloon. The bartender there, Trudy, knows everyone in town. Other than that, there's not much to see. Just people trying to scratch out a living. Well, ain't we all, right? That was a long time ago. I don't pay it much mind anymore. Well, there's...
there's a general store just up the road. You take care. Just a bag that says used. stuff is in case I need it. Okay. Well, it's, uh, what time is it? 6 a.m. I ain't slept a bit. open you up yet I'll wait two hours hi you looking to buy some supplies yup if Ringo doesn't head out on his own I think we should hand him over town shouldn't get itself mixed into the problem don't mistake that for coward talk though we're a town of survivors we'll fight tooth and nail if pushed but we don't go looking for trouble. Can do. Okay, well, um, let's go for weapons. Do you have a varmint rifle? No. Actually, I might. Um, it's more of this trash that I've got. I don't know what the ashtray is for. I don't know what the baseball's for. I have no idea why I put that much tin cans in. That's useful, I think. Oh, chat, pause, do to scroll, what the heck? Don't tell me that. Okay. Um, carton of cigarettes. You can have those. Camera, don't care. Cherry bomb, I don't care. I don't know what a conductor is. Um, that's six of you. Seven of you. Twelve of you. Don't know what the harmonica is for. Two large whiskey bottles. I got 19 of these and I don't know why. Pretty sure I can't use that for anything. And use the medical brace. We can have the milk bottles and the Nuka Cola truck. There's a paint gun. I have five pencils and I don't know why. Pre war money. Sensor module. 
15 tin cans and a toy car. And I feel like I should keep the whetstone and the wonder glue, but I don't really know why. I'll just accept that. This is ammo. Uh, kinda can't really use the 357 Magnum, so we'll just throw that out. That's 5.56 millimeter. I don't have a use for that either. And I got rid of the energy weapon, so you can have the energy cell. Um, putting nine caps towards you, that's fine. Like uh, those ones as well. Nine millimeter rounds, I'll take those. Those are hollow points. All right. That's good. What's next? Just items? Give me a shout if you need anything else. Take it easy now. I'm gonna, um... Uh... Well, my varmint rifle's almost dead anyways. So, there's no real reason for me to keep that. But I'll go back and rebuy them. Hi, Chet. You looking to buy some supplies? Yup. Can do. I made a dumb decision, and apparently I was not supposed to give you my ammo for the 5.56. So I'm gonna make you an amazing payday. And I'm gonna take my 5.56 packs. Alright. Another satisfied customer. Not nah, really. Now. I just really want that wrench, but you know. Beside the point. Because what is it? Uh, auto stim pack, auto injecting. Oh, that could have made an auto inject stim pack. Yeah. Don't know why I'd want an auto inject, but okay. Uh, bottle cap mine. Don't want to do that. Uh, this is conversion. I don't want to do... Cookery to metal? Axle cleaner, cosmic knife... The survival for that. Doctor's bag. Dog hide belt. Charge pack. Gas bomb. Nickel hide belt. What does the Knife, spear, metals to metal, meals to metal, microfusion cell, max charge, overcharge, recycling, satchel charge, really don't want. Okay, super stim packs, require leather belts. Time bomb and a weapon repair kit, which requires scrap metal, which I do not have. 
Wander glue, wrench, and scrap electronics. The only thing is, I don't know how to scrap stuff. Like, is there a way in my inventory? Just... Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. There's... There we go, okay. The reason why I have to keep on doing this, uh, popping out of the game and back, is because for some reason my chat, um, is pausing its auto-scroll. And like, I have... items, I am so sure. I have weapon repair kits. Oh shit. Oh shit. Hi, right, can I? Thank you. Okay, okay, okay. So, the weapon repair kit is why I need scrap electronics and scrap metal. I don't know how to find those, though. Is there, like, in MISC, is there, like, an option? No, that was, that was dropping it. I'll take Wonder Glue, please. Um... Right at Doc's house. Ending machine. Huh. Well, someone took the gas pumps. That's close enough. Who are you? And what do you want with me? Sorry about the gun. You just caught me off guard, that's all. We got off to a bad start. What say we start over with a friendly game of Caravan? You know how to play? It's a two-player game, and the winner takes the whole pie. You build a caravan using the cards in your deck. The goal is to create caravan bids that beat your opponent's bids. So there's more strategy than luck involved. It's why you won't see Caravan in any casino. Too slow-paced. And more importantly, no house edge. Here, take this holotape. It goes into more specifics about the rules. You'll also need a deck, so take one of my spares. So... See, it did it again. It did it right there. It scrolled up. And I don't like it. Okay, so... What we're going to do is we're going to drop this up and hope that that solves my issue. You feel like playing a game? Just keep an eye out for him while you travel. I found cards in old boxes or forgotten on shelves. Can find some for sale too. All right. Yeah. <sighs> He doesn't look very tough, though. I hear he's afraid I'll shoot him down from one of the windows when I see him. And he's right. I'll have a much bigger problem once his friends show up. There's no way I could handle all of them in a gunfight. I'm gonna lay low for as long as I can, assuming the town doesn't throw me to the wolves. I've got no chance against the gang on my own. We just end up sharing the same grave if it's just the two of us. Now, if some of the other people in town were also on board... Start with Sunny Smiles. She's been friendlier than most around here. Nice, but you don't own this place, so... Nope. 
Turpentine, box detergent, tin can, tin can. Doctor's bag, I will take that. Yeast, I will take that too. Nothing in that. Open crate, Sunset Sarsaparilla. Sack. Pork and beans, stim pack, all right. Milk bottle, tin can. Coffee pot. Flour, Abraxo cleaner. Coffee mugs. Fishing battery, nice. Yeah, I'm a I'm a jerk getting in your way. It's it's okay. Open sack. Sugar bombs. Um Case case fantastic, I can make more. Uh clipboard, coffee mug, cups, you know. Hmm. Oh. Okay, so those are his rounds. Card of cigarettes doesn't work though. Cash register. That's all mine. Uh, as for the port safe, um, do I have C lock picking book? Let's see. Um, even powder. Lads of life. Survival. No. Locksmith. Warp. Okay. I'm gonna go get some of my money back. I'll be back. Once again, it is paused due to scroll. What scroll? Stop scrolling. Docs house mostly around ruins. Okay. I'll try to keep that in mind. It's just like this, this, uh, I might have to settings display. Controls, no. Can I just alt enter you? No, it's not gonna you so you don't even have you don't have windowed mode available. Okay, that's apparently gonna be a problem. Howdy. You freaking scared me. Hi. You looking to buy some supplies? Yes. Can do. Okay. Um. Think I'm gonna get rid of these. Uh. Probably keep the machete. Ooh. Baseball bat. Um. I'm not giving up any of those. Well, actually, I'll give up the whiskey and the vodka because I don't need that. Um, yep. I don't do alcohol. Uh, baseball, tin can. Don't remember detergent being needed. Don't remember that being needed. Um, clipboard, coffee mug, coffee pot, and cup. Uh, empty soda bottle. Empty sunset sarsaparilla bottle. Empty syringes we keep. Empty whiskey bottles, we don't. Uh, 
fission batteries are high value. Okay. Uh, I don't see myself needing flour. Or whatever the hell gecko eggs are doing. Or more large whiskey bottles. Need the medical brace. Uh, milk bottle, not required. Pack of cigarettes, not required. Plunger, not required. Um, tin can, don't need. Turpentine kind of seems like something I might want to keep on to. All right. That was misc. Hour to ammo. And now we're good. Except exit. Pleasure doing business with you. All right. Take it easy now. 95 weight again. Do I know what I'm doing half of this for? No. Uh okay, wait. Data quests. Prim, okay, so we'll get that once we get to Prim. Uh, let's go Ghost Town Gunfight. Talk to Sunny Smiles about fighting the Powder Gangers. That's... Where the heck is Sunny Smiles? Here. Hi there. Sticking around Good Springs for a while longer? Sure, what do you want to know? Southeast of here is Prim. Can't miss it. Since it has the giant old roller coaster right in the middle of town. The NCR's got an outpost there. If you follow the road north, you'll eventually hit Sloan and Quarry Junction. They mine rocks or something, but I heard they got troubles lately. I wouldn't head that direction if I were you, though. Got critters up there that don't take kindly to getting shot. The new California Republic. Bunch of settlers and soldiers coming in from the west. Fixing on making Nevada their own. They can be right pushy, but the roads are safer because of them, so I tend to let it go. Not that I got a choice. Well, the wildlife for one thing, rowdy locals for another. They're protecting their own. Just happens to help us. They've been holding off this other group from the east, too. Got a funny name. Call themselves Caesar's Legion. Never seen them in these parts, so I couldn't tell you much. I hear rumors, that's about it. Supposedly, they keep slaves, and they got some real nasty ways of killing folks. But maybe that's just something folks in the NCR cooked up to make themselves seem more useful here. Less uninvited. Around here, mostly coyotes and geckos. The coyotes are pretty dangerous in large packs, but otherwise they're nothing to really worry about. The geckos aren't too tough, but they've got a nasty bite. I've heard about bigger, nastier versions out in the wasteland, but I've never seen them. Stick to the roads when you can, and steer clear of the hills north of Good Springs. The critters up there are big and poisonous. If you want to know anything else, just ask. Ah, uh, no, I think I'm good. I think, I think you kind of covered everything. Um... I hunt geckos mostly. The meat's pretty good and I can always find a buyer for the hides. I also help keep the town clear of rat scorpions and coyotes. Not many people live in Good Springs, so wildlife is always creeping in. Uh, yeah. Sure can. Take the road southeast out of town till it hits the freeway. Prim is the town with a roller coaster straight south. Can't miss it. NCR patrols do a good job of keeping the highway clear, but I'd keep your gun where you can reach it easily. You never know who you'll run into. Off the road, you'll probably start running into hostile wildlife. My advice would be to stick to the highway when you can. Say no more. I'm in. Joe Cobb talks about leaving us alone if we hand over Ringo. But I know his type. He and his friends will come after the town eventually. However, between you, me, and Ringo, we aren't exactly a force to be reckoned with. A lot of people around here look up to Trudy. 
If you could convince Trudy to join us, some of the folks in town might decide to help out as well. I know Easy Pete's got a stock of dynamite somewhere, and Chet just got a shipment of leather armor we could borrow. Talk to them as well. Finally, there's a good chance we'll all end up with extra holes in us. So if Doc Mitchell could cough up some extra stim packs, that'd be great. A silver tongue would help. Convincing Trudy that we had a good plan to win the fight would also help. I don't think give is in Chet's vocabulary. Even with the town at stake, he'd still make you barter with him. Easy Pete's pretty protective of his dynamite. You'd have to convince him you know a thing or two about explosives before you handed it over. I'll be waiting. Okay, um, Trudy, there is a very special, uh, item that, um, I don't think it stacks, so I'm not gonna try. So you're planning on taking on Joe Cobb's gang. It's a big risk, but I suppose you have to do what you think is right. That does sound like a good plan. Did not realize I could right, use sneak. You seem to know what you're doing, so you can count me in. Let me have a word with a few other folks, and I'll see if I can't round up some more members for this militia you're creating. While everyone does own a gun, we could stand to be a little better equipped. The general store probably has what we need in stock. FYI, I can no longer see chat. So if you are talking to me, for whatever reason, um, I cannot see it because this game, for whatever reason on occasion, lets me um, scroll chat for some reason when I'm not paying attention, so. Be careful out there. Thank you. What? Howdy. Bad trouble. Welcome. Too dangerous. Want to kill all yourselves if I let you touch it. Better to leave it buried. Safer that way. Yup. Yup. What? skill was that said it was 21 I have explosives do I have an aid item that helps me with explosives What do you got for sale? I'm sure I've got something you like. I need, um, that does repair. That does speaking. That's barter. Be careful out there. Hmm. Where could I go? Ugh, I gotta always try and talk to Chet. You looking to buy some supplies? You have the most horrifying eyes right now, but um so what you got for sale? Uh specifically in your aid section. That's barter. Nothing else. Okay. Now just hold on. I never voted to take on the powder gangers. That's a thousand cap investment you're talking about. Right. Take it easy now. Barter. I don't have the barter for that. Uh... Shit. 
Data, quests. Um. Let's try and get the dock. Seems like wherever I go, it's always the same. Folks just never leave each other alone. Oh, I'm not much good in a fight with my bum leg. And my supplies are scarce. But I'll give you what I can spare. I ain't got much, but it'll do you more good out there than it will in here. Take what I got. You take care now. Now, problems. Oh, yeesh. Okay, so I can't convince... I don't have the skill in explosives. And I don't have the barter skill. To... Like, my barter is, is horribly low. Um, thousand cap investment. I do not have the caps for that. I have 717. I could sell stuff. Ooh. What am I looking at? Boxing times. Oh. You're empty because I already grabbed you. Meeting people. Sensor module, I'll keep those from now on. Mm, mailbox. That's somebody's crops, can't be stealing those. Energy weapons. Whoa, power flickered. Man, a Yuka. this someone's home fell in that's awful was it your fault This would be all theft. I don't even want to open things just because they're it's illegal. Oh. Got 
it's such a fancy home there, but I... Lucky I'm nice and I don't steal things from people. Um, this looks damaged. Take all of this. And sell the dinner plate. Foot locker empty. BB gun, bees, buff out, teddy bear. Cabinet, wasteland, wanderer outfit. Thank you. Let's go to apparel and let's put on that. What do we look like now? A wasteland wanderer. I'd love to be able to look at myself. I don't know if that is even a button. But okay. This is now my house. If anyone asks. I definitely need to change that hat, but that hat is sticking with me. Mailbox, future weapons today. Nice to meet you. Looks like that's all we're going in with, folks. Whose house is this? Oh, single shotgun. Well, if a bunch of people die, I'll be back. Howdy, partner. Happy trails. I can just walk into Victor's shack? Okay. Desk empty. Weapon repair kit. That's useful. Paper weight. Desk's empty. Can't take that. Oven's empty. Coffee pot, bath and mug, coffee maker, ammunition box, energy cell. Can't quite see, right? But hey.
Case 12, 20 gauge round. Drinking glass, drinking glass. Fishing battery. Well, whoever lived here broke the toilet and the sink. Howdy, partner. Howdy, weird. Okay, well, time to go to the gas station and, uh, well, actually try to sell stuff with Chet. See, then, then if I can barter with Chet. Yeah, I'd rather not wait a few minutes. Like, I do want to see what I look like, but I really wish I could just, you know, see. Oh, mailbox open. Take those. Hello, hello, chat. Come here. You looking to buy some supplies? Yes. Which one we have for sale? Okay, um, I'm not going to need this. Uh, damage per second is that, damage is nine. Yeah, so you can take that. Barman rifle is mine, though. That can be yours. That can be yours. And I'll sell that to you as well. So I'm not gonna need those. Um Bloat fly meat is yours, bleak famine is also yours. Uh not gonna need that. Buff out is a drug, I'm not gonna take that. Gonna get rid of that too. That gives me radiation. That also gives me radiation. Um, I don't do energy weapons, so those can be yours. Uh, the gecko meat, all you. Um, that's a healing thing. That's a healing thing. Uh, probably not going to need that. Um, Medic's not going to need... I'm going to assume I'm not going to need that anymore. Mentats is another drug. Um, that has radiation. That doesn't... That's a drug. That's rad resistance. That has stuff. I'm keeping a stealth boy, just in case. Sugar bombs can suck it. Um... I don't know what this is. But I'll hold on to it. Hold on to that, too. Dinner plate. Drinking glass. Nuka-Cola bottle. Empty sense. Gorilla bottle. Keeping the syringes. Fission batteries. Well, well, I kind of want to keep the hammer for some reason. Um, Iron. Medical brace, keeping that. Paint gun can screw it. Paperweight can screw it. Pencil can screw it. Um, keeping the scrap metal. Keeping the central module. Getting rid of the shot glasses. Getting rid of the teddy bear. Keeping the turpentine. I've never had a use of a whetstone, so I don't know what that is. And we'll give you the yeast. Ammo. Energy cell. All of that. BBs. All of that. Um... Twenty gauge round. All right. And if I click accept, that's over a thousand. That's all I needed. Give me a shout if you need this. Look. That's more like it. The people can pick up their extra ammo and leather armor when they're ready. 
Was there anything else? Goodbye. Take it easy now. Do I want the uh, the explosives? No. It's that's everybody. That's everybody on the list. Except Pete's dynamite, which I think we can live without. All I know is that when it comes to stats, um, evidently speech is something I should definitely level up, but uh, survival might be another one of those really good ones. What's going on? Did Sonny agree to help us? Well, I guess that means we're ready to go. Unless you think there's something else you can do. All right, I'm ready. I hope. Time to look alive. The Powder Gangers are here to play. They're getting set up in cover, but it might not go well unless we get out there soon. At least six, Joe Cobb included. They look pretty mean. I'll be set up near the store. Let's hope that the gang doesn't manage to make it that far. Hey, we'll take the maze. Awesome. Um, I don't care if I've lost karma. Okay, I need those fucking rounds. Weapons. Armament rifle. Aid. Weapon repair kit. Best I can do. Hi, okay. Apparently, we're going with this. Killed. I owe you a huge favor for this. Here, these are technically crypt. I did have what was left of the Crimson Caravan money, but I, w I owe. Excuse me, I'm gonna. Powder gang taking you, taking you, Shein.
We said six, so that's one over there, two, three, four, five. One over here. Two, three, four, five. Supposed to be six. You. Three fifty seven Magnum Revolver. <sighs> yeah, like I'm not mad, I'm not mad about being vilified. It's just like I'm upset Cheyenne died. So now I need to go and talk to It's, I know it's not a quest. I know that that's my next one, but like, I just, I need to talk to, to Sonny. That'll teach the powder gangs to avoid good springs in the future. Not in good springs, no. But if you're up for a little scavenging, there's always the schoolhouse. Most of what's in there is junk, but there's this old safe that even Easy Pete wasn't able to crack with dynamite. If you want to take a shot at it, take these. If the locks... You'll need those to pick the lock. Oh. Well, go ahead and keep this up. Until next... Your dog's dead and you don't even care. You know what? That's just... Y'all are cold. This is just some of the coldest people I've ever met. I'm gonna cook that dog meat and eat it and cry in memory. Of Jeanne. I don't even know which way I'm supposed to go. Hi, uh, world map. So if I take, okay, so I just follow the road. South to Prim, I am still stuck on... Where is it? There was... Down the road a bit more. Oh, I missed the tin can, it's okay. I'm so used to other games where you can scrap tin stuff. to where she is. Oh, I should probably... Items, aid, sunset, sarsaparilla, that'll just get me some of my health back. Uh, before we go to Las Vegas... There's a campfire out here. Or six. This is the problem. I can't cook dog meat. The dog steak. I don't have a survival. <sighs> I'll just be selling that. Definitely animals off it. Oh, 
Oh, it's like someone's home. Which direction do I go? Uh, data. I gotta turn that way. Okay, so I'm just checking this out first. Okay. Whoa! Oh, it crashed! <laughs> ah! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, I was really enjoying that! Oh no! It flat out just poofed! Um... It dead. It deaded. May have saved there. It may have saved just after. Um. Twenty ten. Oh wow! I didn't even graduate high school back then. I was twenty twelve graduation. I have that done now. Yes. Alright, well, it was me going down the road, so... Plus, I'm carrying, like, a buttload of apparel now. Oh my god, Swab Gombler hat. There's a Wanderer out there. Hold up, hold up. That's not my intent. Okay, so that's the plane outfit. Simple. Yep. Plane has the shirt. Thank you. Do I want to... no. What I want to do... I want to do the Desperado Cowboy half of this, and, uh, yeah. We're gonna sell... stuff to chat. I will keep... I'll keep the, um... the guard armor, just because it actually has, like... DT. That was a hell. Damn. Um, hi. Apparel. You're DT6. What am I wearing? DT2? Yeah, I'll sell that. And the gambler hat. And the pre war baseball. And the plane outfit. Um.
the dog meat because I know I can't fit eat that. The jalapeno because I also know I can't do anything with that. Ooh, well, hold up. Jalapeno I can actually eat. I'm just, I was thinking about like me in real life and I was like, oh, I can't eat, um... I can't eat spicy things, so that's gonna be a hurt for me. And then I was just like, the game, people, other people in real life, don't have problems with jalapeno peppers. I'm just one of those people that can't eat jalapenos. I just don't need the 20 gauge. Here. Here's your ammo. I don't need the 20 gauge round. Yup. Uh, let's see. I don't need the cleaver. Absolutely do not need the dynamite. The single shotgun, I don't need. I got the 9mm, I got the silence 22, and I got a magnum revolver. So, with that in mind, I got everything I need. Uh, I'll take those though, and take the hollow point. I'll take the hollow point. This is a higher powered weapon. Give me a shout if you need anything else. Take it easy now. Hi, I need to put on clothes. There we go. Uh, nope, didn't want to do that. Exit that. I'm gonna need this. Hi, let's... What's the problem here? Why can't I do 9mm? I need primer small pistol. Okay. I will hold on to that. First person. Yeah, see, like, I can understand people like not liking things that are spicy, but I actually like spicy things. Like, I genuinely actually like the flavor of spicy things. I like the way that it gets hot. I love that. I hate what it does to my stomach and that it makes me feel like I'm going to die. And I mean that honestly. I have I have um I have dialed 911 on my phone and almost pressed the call button because I thought I was dying. Um So yeah. I uh I got some worries in life and uh and one of them is like I, I like, it's, it's to the point that, like, my stomach issues can, can strike at any time. And, like, I have this intense fear that my intestines and the inside are going to rupture. Just because, like, I've had this for so long in my life that I'm, like, I'm, I'm endlessly worried that the next time that it happens, I'm gonna die. Um, so that doesn't help. That panic doesn't help. Um, because I know that's one of the worst ways you can die. Um, I'm going to try this again. Suitcase empty. Okay, but keep trying to press escape to leave things. Ooh.
Damn. What is this? Gene Sky. Hi, that was rude. Okay, core and a headshot. All right, uh, items. Okay. NCR cash. Interesting. Uh, dynamite. Our gang playing outfit. This was her plane, I see. Well, won't go stealing shit. This is the highway. Hello. Um, yeah, let's, uh... Okay. Am I laser fisting? Release baton. like a old-fashioned cowboy apparently that is what we're going for Pistol. How? Dang. Thank you. 
Ooh. Yeah, I have to be careful about those. I do not care. Y'all, this is a fucking camp. I don't give a shit. You know what? You're after me. I don't care. Oh no, I'm losing karma for stealing from bad people. Like, I get it. You guys are criminals and you wanted to be treated better and I understand that. However, you shot me. I wanted to see if I could disarm it. Uh, what I need to I need to sleep Hello there, it's good to see a friendly face. I almost took you for a raider. I did name's Malcolm Malcolm Holmes. Don't suppose you'd care to trade. I'm missing a few essentials and... Ah, oh, screw this. Lying just ain't in my nature. I'll tell it to you straight. I've been following you for a good bit now. It started off innocently enough. I was traveling, as I often do, and happened to observe you picking up one of those blue star caps. You didn't show any reaction to it, so I figured you didn't know what you'd gotten your hands on. There's an old wasteland legend that says somewhere out there is a fabulous treasure from before the war. Those caps with the blue star on them, the tale goes, are the key to that treasure. They're called Sunset Sarsaparilla Stars. Nah, I gave it up years ago. Too dangerous. And even if I did still collect them, I'd tell you the same. There's people out there so mad with the idea of treasure that they'll attack strangers just on the suspicion that they have some of those caps. No one knows. Money, weapons, water. It is, or maybe was, something of value. And that's enough to get people motivated. Huh. A bare mattress in a burnout van. Yep. Uh, okay. Caps lock, walk slow. All over the place. The easiest place to find them is unopened bottles of Sunset Sarsaparilla. You'd think they'd all have been picked clean by now, but somehow, new bottles keep appearing in the machines. Some say it's old Festus that does it, hoping someone will finally collect enough caps to earn the treasure. Other than bottles, you'll just have to scavenge. You can find caps in the unlikeliest of places, and blue star caps are no exception. It's said that the treasure is guarded by a man named Festus, and he's the one who asked for the blue star caps. It's also said he's been around since the war, standing a lonely vigil, waiting for someone to come and take the treasure off his hands. That'll make him pretty damn old, but I've met a few people in my travels who claim they actually met him, and they weren't the lying type either. No problem. If you do end up trying to collect more stars, watch out for a man named Alan Marks. He's killed several people for their stars already. Hi, um, wait, how do I... Stimpaks just got used. Honey, I slept. Could you please let me have my vision? Thank you. Right, can't do anything on this. Oh, it's stealing. It is not stealing. That dude is just covered in Hello. stuff. 
Hi, Malcolm. Poor dude. Love sleeping on the flat frigging ground. No. I'm not stupid. I saw that. Whoa, okay, that's radiation. Right, I have, um, items that are weapons that are in great need of repair. Awesome. Um, I'm just gonna also repair that one. Like, I know I'm gonna use my pistol. Um, I know I got a varmint rifle as well, but... Well, I'm gonna walk straight into this. Whiskey bottle, empty nuke cola, damn, bottle. Well, that's why there's a whole barrel of nuclear waste in there. Do I know what's happening to me? No. Do I care? No. Barrel? Eight. Don't that's best for I went to miss. No, oh, Sunset Sasperilla Stark, yeah. Alright. Scared myself for a moment. Saw one of them geckos running around. Hate these guys. Okay, buddy boo. I know I'm detected, but you generally don't give a shit about people. Oh no. Why am I off the road? Or Snittle. I'll get back on the road now.
Yeah. I'm well aware my condition is seriously low. My problem is I don't have anything to do to repair it. This is like a little safety stream. I'm a little worried about what I'm about to walk into. Is there like an F5 quick saving? Yes, there is. Welcome to level three. Um, okay. So. Okay, uh, well, okay. Definitely not doing energy weapons, explosives. Guns might be the way to go here. Lock picking. Sneaking. Thirteen skill points and survival. Like, I kind of just want to, like, slam everything into survival just to make shit. That's what I'm gonna do. Survival, lock picking, and science is probably gonna be my like my best options, but then I am gonna need to invest in guns at some point. But uh I just There were three of you. What the frag happened to one of the other ones? Well, whatever. You're gone, and I'm doing that.
that my friend? Hello, take me. So this is Prim. Prim is off limits. Some convicts from the prison up the road have taken over the town. Everyone inside is either dead or in hiding. What's more, there are two tribes of raiders causing trouble in this area as well. You'd be safer heading back up to Good Springs. Be careful. You may want to talk to Lieutenant Hayes. He's in a tent down the road. Just stay on the west side of the overpass if you don't want to get shot. Which is the west side? Oh, this side. Where do you think you're going? Uh, Grim? Empty soda. Don't take that. Empty soda. Empty soda. Empty soda. Empty soda. Not allowed to take any of those. Can't take the empty soda bottle. That's a bed roll. box. Intriguing. Can I get through? No? Okay. Sometimes I want to take the easy way. Oh, I actually don't know what I'm... Oh, I'm wearing one of their helms. <laughs> uh, funny. It's just a goggles helmet, but uh, I want my Desperado cowboy hat because it's about to die, and uh, I will wear that thing until it breaks. Bombed out ruins. Nothing cool to place here. Nah, y'all just you just left it. I Ooh Drinking glass, cup, drinking glass, bent tin cans, shot glass, shot glass. Morning. I'm Sergeant McGee of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. Oh, okay, you want to talk about something, speak to Lieutenant Hayes. I'm from Hub originally. But it's been a long time since I saw him. I'm on my second tour here. Most non-commissioned officers are. Ma'am. Where? Well, that's worrisome. I don't know why I keep picking up cans. This is so wild. Oh, I don't want to take any of this. This is y'all personal effects. I'll leave. Thank you. Who the heck are you? Patrol in the Mojave almost makes you wish for a nuclear winter. Nice. Hey. I'm Lieutenant Hayes of the New California Republic Army, 5th Battalion, 1st Company. What's your business? We were sent out here to hold back the tide of convicts from the correctional facility. As you can probably tell, we aren't doing the kind of job we could be doing. The mission isn't a problem. The problem is with supplies. The convicts are better armed and organized than our intel initially suggested. I'm trying to get some reinforcements here, maybe some guns with some firepower, but shit. Things are just going slow. Most people just call it NCRCF. That's NCR Correctional Facility. A little bit ago, the convicts there staged a coup. Killed the guards that weren't able to escape. And have been ransacking the area since then. 
Not much. They've taken to calling themselves powder gangers, mostly because they've taken to using the explosives meant to clear boulders as weapons. They got organized faster than I would have thought, most of them at least. Thankfully, the small group in town here seem to have split off from the main force, so they aren't getting anything in the way of support. I have some free time. Ask away. Ma'am. 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 All right, well, I'm gonna do what y'all couldn't do. Not because I'm a hero of the story, just because I'm a dumbass and I like walking into, th into things head first. Hi. You've lost? Nope. Oh, that is a mine. Who am I supposed to talk to? Stats, data. Quests. Hmm, okay. Well. Sorry to fuck up your guys' day. Oh. It's time for fun now. And my shovel, tire iron, fire and rifle. Bye. Sneaky and slow. Egg time. Do I know why I'm collecting a whole bunch of shit? Nope.
That gives me condition up. Items. Aid. Okay, so I'm, I'm like seeing some stuff that I missed. Um, am I over encumbered yet? No, I'm not. Okay. Perception, okay.
weapons. Oh, I got a varmint rifle. This is awesome. R. U. Uh, let's do... Let's do the silenced for the moment. Just sneaking around. You probably don't need to be sneaking this much. He's dead. Side entrance to the Vicky and Vance. This is dark.
this Rado Cowboy hat. Caravaneer outfit. Well, on me, it looks absolutely fabulous. Guns 5, Charisma 1. I think I know what I'm going as, guys. I think I know from this point forward, I will be running the Magnum Resolver. Are you all right, right? There was a cowboy repeater, wasn't there? Heavens. Ooh. Box. Flammer fuel. Okay. I think we're good on lead, actually. The thing that we need the most is, uh... Pistol Primer. Let's check our apparel. The Sheriff's Hat does one perception, but it has absolutely no damage rating to it. The Merc Veteran does two guns, two weapons, uh, two melee weapons, which I don't really use melee weapons too often. Sheriff's Duster does one charisma, five guns, and you do that and endurance. I think I think the sheriff's hat stuff actually is the best option. Whoa. Here I am running around, not sure what I'm doing. Like hi. Um Do I fire a warning shot to find out where everyone is? I was searching I was initially searching for a better way in to this building. But I don't think there is a better way in. Give me just one moment. I want that to reset. There we go. Continue. Ba -ba -da. The big building with the door is an angle. You can go through the door, it's safe. So wait, I can go through this door? Building under the roller coaster is less safe. Okay. Thank 
Fuck you. I don't know what it was brought you to Prim, youngster, but you might want to rethink your plans. Town's gone to hell. That beat up old thing? What do you want to know? A courier dropped it off a couple of months back. I got it working for a little while, but the darn thing pooped out. I haven't been able to get it up and running again. I was hoping to use it for some courier work, but that ain't gonna happen. Are you welcome to... If I had my way, I'd dump it in the scrapyard in Novak and be done with the damn thing. Hell if I know. I don't think it's serious, but my tinkering days are long gone. I guess I don't have anywhere better to be. Well, I'll answer what I can. Sure do. I run the courier office out of my shop. Leastways I did before things went to hell around here. Well, I don't got any work right now, sorry to say. I'll tell you whatever I can. You have a delivery order you can show me? Oh, you're talking about one of them packages. That job had strange written all over, but we couldn't turn down the caps. Well, now that you've mentioned it, a few nights back, one of the townies was out scavenging for supplies. He said he saw a fellow with a daisy suit come through with some of them great con misfits. They was talking about a chip. Well, for that, your best bet is going to be talking to Deputy Beagle. Since they came to town, he was keeping a good bit of notes on them, and he was slinking around Bison Steve when your pretty boy friend came through. He may have heard where they were going. That cowboy robot had us hire six couriers. Each was carrying something a little different. Paradise, chess piece, that kind of stuff. Last word I have in the office, it looked like payment had been received for the other five jobs. Guess it was just your chip that didn't make it. First deadbeat we hired to do the job canceled. Hope a storm from the divide skins him alive. Well, that's where you came in. Yeah, I said sure as lack of rain, you were still kicking. Then he turned down the job, just like that. I asked if he was sure it was good money. No. Let Courier 6 carry the package, that's what he said. Like the Mojave sort you out or something. Then he just up and walked out. No idea. Sounds like you two had a history for him to act like that. And turn down the money too. Hope he didn't see any trouble in that package of yours. Maybe he thought your name was bad luck. Not enough for me to say. Nope. Different fella. Bigger. Had himself a face on a screen. And he talked more like you or me. Don't go getting yourself shot. I do not want to shoot people. Thank you very much. Oh, okay, well, it is 10 o'clock. I'm going to drop a save here. And we will be coming back to see how well we do. So, uh, for the time being, uh, thank you guys all for coming to watch. Well, we're going to do this. Thank you all for coming to watch. Uh, I'm going to try and do more of these throughout the week. Um, but uh, um, thank you all for coming to watch. And I'm, I'm happy to stream. I'm just trying to get back into it. I'm not really sure if I'm like entertaining. So if you have any like critiques um, or criticisms, please let me know. Uh, you can either sort of uh, um, DM me on like Tumblr. You can you can get in contact with me uh, through um, actually pretty much pretty much anything. Um, uh, I have transfer about social. I've got my my uh, stuff linked. 
Um, so if you want to like uh, throw me a DM and just uh, uh, tell me how I'm doing, what what you think I could change? Like I'm I'm in the process of kind of uh, still learning how to stream, but yeah. Okay. Um, I will let you all go. Uh, take care. Be safe. Uh, and sorry, my brain just kind of got distracted. Um, yes, I will. I will mind my health. <laughs> uh, so take care. Be safe. Um, and I'll catch you guys all next time on the next stream. Bye.